I don't know if that's audible in the background, but my PlayStation 4 currently sounds as if it's trying to take off. A man walks into his office. He loads up a game, he sets it down, he attempts to play it and he predicts what'll happen. He wonders if he'll have fun, if he'll get mad. He wonders if it'll be the worst gaming experience he'll ever have. He asks himself, which is it? It's as bad as, bad as that's gonna goddamn get- So, let me reload what's gonna happen right here. I'm on the hardest possible difficulty of Witcher 3. This is mainly in part of the fact that the, that the wonderful people over there on Patreon v voted for this over other instances that I shan't name, so that maybe they do see the light of day, but this is what I'm doing to myself. Maximum difficulty on the Witcher when I haven't played it in several years. I'm sure no one even gives a fuck about this, but we're gonna do it. And I'm gonna accomplish something. I don't know what that is, but I'm- I'm gonna! Let's go to mid-cops. I can fast travel. You cannot fast travel from here. Then why does it say I can fast travel here? A hair. Okay, I can fucking kill you. How do I- how do I- how do I hurt this? I- well, I mean, that works. It's a bit fucking unnecessary, though. I was going for a sword. Let's just set the poor little bugger on fire. Ah, cool. Why are people popping in within five feet of me? Hands off my plums. I believe you need to be reporting that to HR, not a board in the middle of the village. Nicholas Friedman. You cannot attack this target. I just wanted to do a bit where I set him on fire. Fuck this game. Very well. That I can pay with a clear conscience. Oh man, I asked for a bonus of a... of a meager 27 or whatever the hell. Put my life on the line to do the work that you couldn't be asked to do. Fuck you. Extra seven coins. Ah yes. Have a- have a Terry's chocolate orange on me, my man. You, you know what? Well, I'm coming back and I'm gonna set you on motherfucking fire and we're gonna really make you a fried man. You- you appear to be re rendered a lot worse right about now. A lot worse. You were somehow better close up. I don't know how you manage that. I'm fucking standing here! Ah, oh, I'm on a quest, uh, to see a witness. And, uh, I- I'm- I've got the important individual to speak to known as woman. So much so that apparently Qui-Gon Jinn over there needs to practice the fucking force. Will you buy a round for a victim of the beast? How about I buy you three rounds, you could be a victim of this beast. You know what I'm saying? Can I stick my dick in your coda? <laughs> I thought I walked into a broth, but what can I say? Excuse me, madam. Pardon me. I'd like to fuck you. I think you'll tell me everything I need to know. Bottle or no bottle. Oh, no. I'm the one doing the Jedi mind tricks. I... Okay, never mind. Ah, head clip. That was nice. I really like that. Apparently the real secret to alcoholism is having a neck that just breaks. Couldn't see what it was, but it wasn't no human. I mean, I don't think you're human. I can see the seam in your neck and there's a hole and I can see into the abyss. Were you attacked by a vampire with a saw blade and he glued your head back on because he didn't do a good motherfucking job? God damn it, 50 coins. I don't have 50 coins. Okay, so I need 50 coins to do this quest to save you potentially from the, 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 the catacan, whatever the fuck that is, from coming back. Do you have some money for me? I don't know how I get money in this game, I haven't played it in a- Stop looking at me like that, you fucking bitch. Fuck you! Oh, well, that went well. Okay, how am I gonna get these fucking coins? I was led to believe this was a door. Oh, only that one is door. Ever think about opening both of those so people don't get confused while your window pops in behind you? I'll sell that for 250. Yeah. Now I can go on my fighty magoos by getting some drinky magoos. Then... And then getting sad that I likely can't kill the boss and playing me some of the blues. Sitting on the dock of the bay, watching the tide away. Okay, I am playing a quest as a witcher where I wanted to fight things, going around, being drunk, singing in the streets. Meanwhile, my walking animation, you, you couldn't even tell I'm even the slightest bit imbibed. Over oh Jesus, mother of God! What's going on here? Okay, that's a little bit of a, it's a little bit of a. Okay, that's a very close to dead breath. That's well, actually, no, it isn't. That was only one tickle. I've got this bitch. No, I don't. Woo! Okay, I got you, bitch. Ah, just oh, think I broke it. Hey, I didn't do that. I was doing good. Also, that that man with the crossbow back there didn't actually do anything. You didn't help at all. Can I ask why, sir? Can I ask why you just watched- You're looking back at me now! You definitely saw what happened! Why didn't you help?! You're a motherfucker! Come get me, monster. I don't know where you are, but you- You come get me in my goddamn Star Wars prequel bubble of those rollerballs. Oh, fucking win. I know. I'll climb the ladders. And then I'll jump in from the roof. And then when I find it, I'll be locked in with it, and I'll die. No. Oh, jeez! That's fucking really- I'm gonna die. I'm actually gonna die. What's the lock-on button? I'm dead. 
I'm dead because I don't even know the buttons. Now, could you inform me what the lock-on button is? Because Brett still actually isn't sure. It's okay, though. I got you. Ow. I got you under my skin. I got you deep in the heart within. Matter of fact, my sword's just going deep within your fucking heart. Get out of it, Gale, you suck! Okay. I did it. I've got a butcher's hook going in my eye hole. But he's dead. I still don't know what button locks on, assuming any at all. But I won. I got a hideout. Oh, yeah, because I, as a weird wildebeest, also, too, have a hideout and use keys and wander about the exhibits with me, mate. You know, when I look like a fucking cockerel's arsehole, I, too, have a hideout. Hello, poorly rendered dirty teeth man, I'm back. What matters is you snuffed it out. Due some praise for that, Witcher. <laughs> oh, I'm due some praise. Only seven extra bonus coins, though. Thanks, man. You could say you marry Omi one for those spare coins, but no, 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 no. Fuck me, rough ride in the bumhole. Only seven extra coins for me. I sold shit in my satchel worth just as much as I did for this. You know how much effort that required? Walking to shop going, hey, mate, have these tears for the coins. I put my life on the line for this. No, you can... I'd get mad. I would, but I, I still can't burn him, can I? That's it. Put the torch on him. Burn him. Burn him. You burn him alive! Eat a dick! God! That was truly vicious, and she's got nipples that look awful! Alright, you cockatoo. It's just me and you. Bring it. Where is it? Where'd it go? It's a cockatrice, actually. I'm sorry, I- I just saved your gender! It's actually dying like fucking mad! Oh! Fucking actually, there's two people on that list of dying like mad. I'm with you. I'm not in this fight for foul play. You get it? It's because you're a bird. A bird of flight. I just gave you a first class ticket to hell. I mean, thanks. Thanks for coming. That was a lot easier than I expected. You were a giant wildebeest. The size of a fucking mud hut that the piece of shit that I just beat lived in. And then you posed less of a challenge than the saggy breasted individual that was wallowing around in her own feces and trying to cover me in them. You're the epitome of a disappointment, I hope you know that one. You will rooster the day that you messed with me. If you still had sentience and one dead. Okay. You're gonna give me a clean 300. That's what you're gonna do. Just a smidgen too high, that. Okay, smidgen, he says. Five. Seems like a smidgen. Just a smidgen too high, that. Alright then, I assume you just meant eight. Just a smidgen too high, that. Okay then, how about a bonus fucking ten coins for me? Just a smidgen too high, that. What is the point of this feature? Don't worry, Baron's henchman. I'm sure he's gonna really, really feel valued that he hired you. After 705 hits, and you did nothing to me at all. You're floating on nothing. You're floating on your own value. What do you got, bitch? Can I even loot you? I can't even loot him. I murdered a man and he has no pocket. Pockets. That's the face of a dead man. Ah, the horror in his- Did, did that corpse just blink? Is, <laughs> is that corpse blinking at me? Are his eyes ma- His- uh, I have killed a man. His eyes are wandering. And he's still blinking. I'm sorry, I think we're in- I think we're in a small order. I think- I think we need just a little bit- Just a little bit of a light cremation here. Can we- Can we maybe just get this process on and done? He's suffering, bless him. I'm sure he'll appreciate it in the long run. I- he, uh, chip, Did he j Ladies and gentlemen, Zora High! Why the fuck am I going out risking my life when I can die when he can't? Hey, chip, I take that back. He should be out there auditioning to be one of the heads in the Haunted Mansion reboot. What the fuck? Hello, officer. Oh, I'm sorry. No, forgive me. Let me, let me, let me, let me sheath my- Let me to break my arm. Help me! Ah! Okay. Will do as I randomly rolled for some reason I'm yet to be able to decipher. Tell me. The, the others are- Oh, they're, they're dead. dead. I mean, come on, you were better rendered than them. You had facial animation. You should have known you would have lived. I'm sorry, are you sitting back down in this cave where there are monsters? There you go. I even dropped the drawbridge for your farmer's wife. Now you can go. If only you weren't married, then you could drop your drawers for me. Good luck out there. There aren't dragons or anything. Me and you, uh, Harisi. Oh, you have copious amounts of health. Oh, and poison while we're at it. Um, uh, ouch. I got you. I got your bomb. Even though you keep doing this annoying poison, which serves as nothing other than a deterrent for me to actually engage you. That's not engaging, let me tell you something about that! Uh, oh. Oh! <laughs> okay, you little bitches have come back alive. This is really nice. I'm really enjoying it. Especially the, uh, the stagger, the stun, and being fucking flung across the room all the time! Ah, yes, this as well. This is also my personal favourite! Oh! 
Ready to install! What you're buying? I mean, I'm glad! I'd be worried if it wasn't! Nice weird little animation glitch there, fella! Okay, now Harris. Uh, uh, I know Rolf's had some bad days lately, and you probably feel like you need to avenge his honor, but please, it's fine! You, you, you can live your own life and not be in the shadow of him! Stop fucking running toward me! There you go. I'm getting it. I'm really getting it, Mum. I'm really starting to get it. It's his arse! Poison the son of a bitch! Oh, I think I have- Oh, God! I think I've made him bleed what I was about to say, and now I'm bleeding. Fucking stop standing around holding your fucking hair, Geralt! Got you! Alright! Die! Harris! Drop dead! Oh. Well, after spending about 50 minutes killing every single one of its ads, which were, you know, its descendants, I'd say I wiped out Harris's family line. And I guess given how much time he spent building up his little fellas, his only reaction could be, I sure feel like a real arachnidiot. And that's the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please do like it, share it, and like it. Please do like it and let me know. And if you want to see more, do let me know as well. And also, there's a link in the description to follow me on Twitter. Keep up to date with everything. There's a link, link for merch if you want to actually get some clothes for your body that's got my stuff on it. Or you can just watch the videos on screen. One from somebody else, two from me. I appreciate you either way. Uh, thank you very much for watching this again. And hopefully, I will see you in the next one.